Hi guys, welcome to my channel Learn in Minutes and today let's learn how to mix and use the periodontal dressing. The periodontal dressing is basically used to cover a surgical site. Uh, for this we will require a glass lab or a mixing pad. Uh, you need a spatula to mix the periodontal dressing, a probe to secure the periodontal dressing, some saline and of course the periodontal dressing material. In this case we, I will be using the Copac which is a non eugenol based periodontal dressing material. It consists of a base paste and a catalyst paste. Uh, so let's begin. We take the base paste and dispense a certain amount depending on the surgical site. Uh, this amount will be usually sufficient for one quadrant and we take the catalyst paste and the point to be noted here is to dispense equal lengths of the catalyst paste. Now we take the spatula and try to mix this paste into a smooth well blended mass. Initially it will be a little sticky, tacky and difficult to manipulate but later on once the base paste and the catalyst paste react well wherein the zinc oxide and the fatty acids combine and the reaction is completed you get a mass that can be well manipulated and try to make sure that both the paste blend in with, the, with each other make uh, a note of the way I'm holding the spatula you need to hold it parallel to the glass slab and get the mass into a smooth well blended one now we've almost reached that stage where you know you see it's it's not gooey or very uh, sticky anymore you can collect the entire amount in your spatula and then dip your fingers into a little bit of saline so that it doesn't stick to your gloves okay or you can also use petroleum jelly and now slowly take it off the spatula you have enough working time so you don't need to panic make it into a round mass and then uh, mold it according to the type of uh, surgical site I am making it into an elongated mass I have a cast here um, supposedly we have reflected the flap on this quadrant so Considering I've reflected the flap on the teeth from canine to molar, I'm going to slowly adapt this. In the patient, you have the cheek muscles which you can use to mold this material onto the teeth and also in the vestibular area. Other than that, you can slightly here in the cast, I'm using my fingers, you, you too can use your fingers or the patient's cheek to mold here. Now the only point you need to consider is you do not extend this too much deep down into the vestibule because it can dislodge the material and also make sure that it does not extend up to the occlusal surface because it will interfere in the patient's chewing. Now you can take a probe and slightly press it in the interdental area so that it, the dressing is well stabilized and maintained in that position and held firmly and secure and does not move and protects the surgical site without applying too much pressure or too much force just blend in the entire material without any sharp edges and here we are done with the periodontal dressing so another tip before i just close up is it's very easy to clean this uh, dressing material the only thing you need to use is uh, some amount of petroleum jelly in a cotton and you can rub this area and the entire mass will be off the glass slab within seconds that's all for now guys hope this video was useful to you guys thank you